Yo guys, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. My name is Jayster. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to the channel. Glad to have you guys here. Today we're going to be doing another step-by-step -step guide for the Pokemon install for TCG Card Shop Simulator. Now, these past couple videos have been doing pretty well, and I've been helping a lot of people, which that's why we do this. And today... We actually got a new update to the TCG Card Shop Simulator game, which added comic books. That's really cool. I love that developer is staying on improving on the game and adding stuff. And with that, of course, we have a new update for the Pokemon, which Red Hex is on. So shout out to Red Hex for actually staying on top of things. And yeah, I'm going to show you guys how to download this new mod. Now, if you guys already got the past mods to work, then you pretty much have to just skip to the end of the video to install the mod itself i'm sure you probably guys already know how to do it if you guys have already got the mod to work but if you guys haven't or just want to you know follow with the video you guys can do so but this more so goes to the people that have been trying to mod it and haven't got it to work or the people that are getting into the game for the first time and are trying to mod the game and have these pokemon skins in your game so that goes mostly to you guys but yeah guys hope you guys enjoy this video if you guys do make sure you guys hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you guys are new we play a variety of games we live stream here as well and i would definitely like to have you here part of the community so without further ado let's jump into the video and install this mod shall we all right first order of business is we're gonna go ahead and go to steam and we're going to uninstall because like i said we are going to be doing this with a fresh game so we're going to go to manage browse local files we're going to go to our files here for the game and just delete all of them so we're going to delete that that's done we're going to go back to common make sure everything is deleted so we'll delete this folder as well so just make sure all that tcg stuff is deleted from your files here that is done we can back out go to the game and we go to manage and uninstall it so if you guys have been trying to install any of the mods in the past and haven't got it to work please follow this step so you can reinstall the game and have fresh files we'll go back to this game install it so that should be pretty quick we'll go here empty our stuff here close that just emptying out my recycle bin there all right the game is freshly installed awesome now the next thing that you want to go ahead and do is install the files so we're going to go to the website right here and i will have it linked down below so it can make your guys' job easier so this is going to go for the people that have not installed the game you want to download three files which are going to be we'll go right here to the description and we'll go to the bottom. You need Pepin EX and Texture Replacer. Now, what you want to go ahead and do is download Pepin EX. So we'll open up a new link there and a new tab there. So those are going. We'll go back here. And then Pepin EX is right here, guys. You guys want to go to Files. And then we want to hit Pepin EX Pack for TCG Card Shop Simulator. Manual Download. You'll hit slow download by the way you guys need an account on this website if you guys want to download any type of files so just hit slow download this will pop up giving you about five seconds for it to start downloading and then boom that's downloading that's off to the side we can go to texture replacer now and then we will go to files same thing texture replacer 1.0.3 this is actually a new update to the texture replacers so we can actually download that bam slow download and again five seconds for it to start downloading so we'll let that go now the final file that we do need is the pokemon 4.3 which is the new one now we actually go to files you can see some of the new things that this does provide which if you guys are running you know 4.0 3.5 i highly recommend you guys actually updating it so make sure to update texture replacer to the latest version which we just downloaded updated the latest version of the game added comic books removed music to lighten the mood and prevent issues so yeah guys if you guys don't hear the music after 4.3 that's because they did do that intentionally added ogre ogre pawn pretty weird name probably butchered that and bulk boxes so you guys want to download 4.3 we're going to download that slow download give it five seconds this one is going to take the most to download because it is a lot of files so we'll open this up and it's going to be two minutes. So not bad, not bad. Let me get a sip of my coffee while we wait 
for this to download. Yeah, and I'm showing you guys this on real time so you guys can see for yourselves. So we're actually start extracting the other files. Let me actually delete these since we're starting all over and downloading them from scratch. So you guys want to go to your downloads. And right here, we have the texture replacer and the Beppin EX. So let's extract the Beppin EX folder first. So we'll right mouse click there and we'll go to extract all. Leave the file as is. Just extract that. We'll close it. We'll have that to the side and then we'll bring it up over here. There we go. And then we'll extract the texture replacer. So again, same thing. We're going to extract all. There we go. That is extracted. Easy peasy. So we'll bring it back over here. Make sure you guys extract these files because it won't work. So now we can just minimize that. We have these two. We can wait for the mod itself to finish downloading here, which is almost done. 15 seconds. But yeah, it's pretty cool that they added comic books. <clears throat> So looking forward to what designs we have for the Poke mod. So there we go. Now that's downloaded. We can minimize that. Go back to downloads. And then it's right here. Poke mod version 4.3. We're going to extract this. There we go. Again, this one's going to take more because there's more items. 613 items. So that's definitely more from before, of course, with the comic books added and all that other stuff that they are providing. So we'll close that up. And then we have it right here. Pokemon version 4.3. Let's go, baby. So let's bring that right there. So these are the three files you guys are going to need. Now we can close that up. Then now we're going to go to Beppin EX. We're going to open it. And we're going to copy these files right here. So we're going to copy those. We'll set that off to the side there. Open up TCG Card Shop Simulator. Go to Manage Browse Local Files. And then right here on the first folder that comes up, as you guys can see, I have my mouse cursor right here. I'm just going to go to the right, right here. Right mouse click in. And then we're going to paste the files right here. There we go. That's done. So we'll go back over here. Close that and then the next thing that we're going to do is copy texture replacer so we'll click in we'll copy this folder inside texture replacer copy this folder right here copy close it go back to tcg card shop simulator browse local files we're going to go into the new Beppin ex folder that we just installed we're going to go to plugins and then we're going to copy that texture replacer folder right in here so we'll put that there that's done deal all right guys for the final step we're gonna go ahead and open up the pokemon folder we're gonna copy this folder right here tcg card shop simulator so we're gonna copy that folder we can close that up now we're done open up steam now here we go to browse local files and then all right guys right here this is very important on top, you have program files. We have Steam, Steam apps. You guys want to go to common. Make sure you guys go to common. And right here, I already have the folder installed because I did a test run to see if the game actually worked and it did. So right here, you're not going to have that. So just ignore it. But once you're here, you go to the right. Same thing. Right mouse click in and you're going to copy the folder right in here. So it's going to go right there. For me, it's going to say to replace the files because I already have the folder. It might say it for you too. If it does, just replace the files. But it might not for you because it did it for me the first time. So that'll be cool. So now that it's in there, regardless, you can close this up and you can actually launch the game. And then it should be working for you guys. So let's launch it up and see for ourselves and check out these comic books, shall we? All right, here we are. Mod is working. As you guys can see, Pokemon by Red Hex. We're going to load game. This is a good sign already right here. And again, we did start from scratch. We deleted the game. We deleted the files, but so we started fresh. So we have the original music. So, I mean, it makes sense, I guess. So we don't have to be worrying about when the game updates that it breaks the music. So let's go inside. This is my shop as of right now. We're doing some remodeling. We got to do some restocking, but let's actually open up the shop here and go to accessories and check out these new comic books, shall we? 
Woo! There they are, guys. Comic volume one. We have red and Pikachu. Blue. Nice. Yellow version. Nice. Hell yeah, man. That is clean, dude. <clears throat> I was already thinking when I saw the update, when the original game got updated and saw the comic books, which are pretty cool. I love TCG Car Shop Simulator. Such a cool, cozy, fun little game. And the fact that we can actually add these mods is crazy and awesome. And now that we have these cool Pokemon comic books, man, the game's just going to keep on getting better, man. Shout out to Red Hex for making this possible, man. This is so cool. And yeah, guys, that's how you download the new update for Pokemon TCG Card Shop Simulator. Hopefully this helped you guys out. Make sure you guys hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Take care. Peace.